The regular iPad is for sure the best bang for buck option out there. Cheaper than the Air and the Pros, and recently the ninth generation iPad was released. Today we're talking about the best accessory for the iPad, the Logitech Combo Touch, which in combination with the iPad 9th generation might turn it into a must have for students. And in this video, I'm gonna tell you why. Hi, my name is Felix and this is How To Creative with everything you need to create. Last year, I graduated cum laude from my International Media and Entertainment Management University and I have been using a MacBook for most of my note-taking during this time. But to be honest, it is quite big and expensive and not very versatile. Why I'm telling you this is because I would have loved to use the Logitech Combo Touch uh, with an iPad during my study. Uh, so if you're studying right now, I think this should be a great tool. First of all, with the flexible kickstand of the Logitech Combo Touch, you can use it in four different modes almost anywhere you are. Dock the keyboard and pull out the kickstand 60 degrees for a typing mode. Type your long essays with ease. Catch up on your email or your to-do list while you're on your way. Fully extend the kickstand for a drawing mode. Draw illustrations and make quick notes during your lectures and highlight the most important quotes and sentences in your digital study books while you're studying. Talking about that, fold the kickstand for reading mode I never bought a single physical book, so this also makes it great to read your books and study for exams. And finally, the viewing mode, view your online lectures, participate in some video calls, or watch your favorite series to relax. From the outside, the Logitech Combo Touch functions as a protective case with a sleek design. Not only is it complementary to the beautiful space gray color of the iPad, but it also allows you to store a digital pencil, uh, the Logitech Crayon in this case, which uses Apple technology, so you can use it right after you turn it on because it doesn't need pairing. You can also store the first gen Apple Pencil on the Combo Touch, and furthermore, the iPad turns on and off automatically when closing the lid. And this all in a very comfortable size to make it convenient to bring along with you. The keyboard is about a 75% keyboard, which keys have around one millimeter of travel with a scissor mechanism. And it's not mechanical, which if you're a long-term follower of this channel, you know I'm a huge fan of, but the keys are nothing more or less than you would expect from a very compact keyboard. What does surprise though is the backlit feature, which allows you to keep working in the late hours, uh, which if you're a student probably wouldn't be your first time. The full row of iOS shortcuts is also very nice. And this in combination with the multi-touch trackpad uh, makes it great for productivity. The only thing I would have loved is a complete area of click because right now you cannot click the top of the trackpad, but this is a minor detail. The complete keyboard with trackpad is connected with the uh, smart connector, uh, which sources power directly from the iPad, pairs it and transfers data. This makes it easy to detach the keyboard when you don't need it. Talking about that, there are also some alternatives if you don't necessarily need the trackpad. The Rugged Folio or the Slim Folio, which is even smaller, the Combo Touch is also available for the iPad Air and iPad Pros if you want a little more power out of your system. If you're interested, you can find the links to all these products in the description below. And these are affiliate links, which will give me a little kickback. So thank you so much for clicking. Also, let me know in the comments below what you think of the Logitech Combo Touch in combination with the iPad 9th generation. I hope you like this fast-paced, short type of video, and thank you so much Logitech for partnering up with me for this video and providing me with the products. Subscribe for more creative tech and tools, leave a like on your way out, and I hope to see you in the next video. And don't forget, stay creative.